Hello, we continue next second lecture. We start from das verb. Das verb is meaning is the das verb is meaning is the verb. Okay? And in the in German language we have like English we have also present time. In uh, for in the German we have ending we have a ending which we can add for the root of the verb. In the Germany root of the verb plus en or n we can see the parts of the verb okay and when we want to use in the uh, sentence we have to add the ending depend on the person we want to use it for example Richard und bitte kommen. See? Richard and Peter come. Sie sagen. You say or they say. We are biting viel. We work a lot. Arbeiten Sie auch viel? Do you work a lot? Herr Müller, Mr. Müller. Herr Müller antwortet. Herr Müller answer. Yeah. Yes. Aber ihr arbeitet viel, but you, you work a lot und lernt langsam, but when the learn slowly. Learn to do Deutsch, do you learn German, Anton? Arbeitest du viel? Do you work a lot? Ja, yeah, ich lerne Deutsch, yes, I learn German und arbeite viel and uh, works a lot. You see here, we have two verbs, fragen and antworten. Antworten, if you see the root of the verb is arbeit. Oh, excuse me, the root of the verb is antwort. Plus en. And because, as you see in the here, okay, the end of the verb is the T. Okay, root end of the root is the T. In this case, when we want to use the person, okay, for example, ich arbeite, ich antworte, for example, du antwortest, er antwortet, wir antworten, er antwortet, sie antworten. Okay, as you see here, for fragen, ich frage, we add ending E, for do, Du, du fragst, you ask, wie ein DST. Du fragst, er fragt, es fragt, sie fragt, he, she, and Okay, neutral, they ask, wie fragen, in, ending. I fragt, sie fragen, sie fragen. As you see here, Uh, we have this ending which we can add for the verb and uh, but if we have it if the root has ending with t in the second personal do and uh, in the third r s c and in the ear we have to add extra e because in this case double t is close each other and in the pronunciation it can be problem for example arbeiten ich arbeite du arbeitest er arbeitet we arbeiten ihr arbeitet sie arbeiten ich arbeite i work du arbeitest you work er arbeitet he works we arbeiten we work Ihr arbeitet, you plural work, sie arbeiten, they work, sie arbeiten, you plural work. Okay, also, also, uh, also we can use for fragen, other example, gehen, ich gehe, I go, du gehst, you go, er geht, he go, es geht, it go, sie geht, she goes, wie geht, Gehen, we go. Ihr geht, you plural go. Sie gehen, they plural go. 
or we can say for the lernen, learn, liegen, if they lie in the place, kommen, come, sagen, say, üben, practice. Now we go to the übung. Übung is the for the practice. Okay, we can say also for homework. The übung, übung. Okay, and the plural, plural form is the die Übung. Richard und Butte kommen. Aus England. Sie lernen hier Deutsch. Richard und Butte comes from England and they learn here German. Ich frage Richard Robeson und Butte Carles. Kommen Sie aus Spanien? I ask. Frage. I ask. From Richard Robertson and Peter Carles. Kommen Sie? Do you come from Spanien? Spain? Nein. We kommen aus England. No. We come from England. We kommen nicht aus Spanien. We don't come from Spanien. Spain. Ich frage Anton Brega. I ask Anton Brega. Gehen Sie hier in die Schule? Do you go here in the school? Ja, ich lerne hier Deutsch. Yes, I learn here German. Ich gehe in die Schule und arbeite viel. I go here in the school and uh, works a lot. Anton fragt und Richard antwortet. Anton asks and Richard answers. As you see here, because antwortet, you see the root ending is T, we add ET, part of, but for the fragt, because not T, we can just add T. Kommt ihr aus England? Do you come from England? Arbeitet ihr oft zusammen? Do you work often together, zusammen together? Ja, aber bitte arbeitet nicht viel. But bitte doesn't work a lot. He learned schnell. He learns fast. Ja, Richard, du arbeitest viel. Du arbeitest viel. Yes, Richard, you work a lot, aber du lernst langsam, but you learn slowly. Ich frage und du antwortest. I ask and, and you answer. Die Schüler fragt. Die Schüler fragen. Sorry, because in this say because die Schüler is the plural form. Und der Lehrer antwortet. And uh, then uh, the students ask and the teacher antworts, answers. <coughs> One of the important verbs in the German or other language it is to be. Sein is to be. Ich bin, I am, du bist, you are, it is, es ist, sie ist, he, she, it, is, we sind, we are, ihr seid, you are, plural, sie sind, they are, sie sind, polite, you are. Das Verb sein ist unregelmäßig. The, fair, the verb sein, to be, is unregel, messig. It is, it hasn't uh, uh, regular rule. Okay? Because, because we have two types of verbs. 
Uh, as you will study last page, uh, we, for example, Fragen and Arbeiten, we can have a, a special ending and uh, for the root, and it is a regular message. The shape of the verb, uh, it is it is constant, and just we add the root, some uh, ending, and the sentence will be complete. But on regular message, the shape of the root or shape of the fair, verb can be changed. For example, übung, the übung. Uh, we can uh, do together. Sind Sie aus Paris? Are you from Paris? Ja, we sind aus Paris. Yes, we are from Paris. Nein, we sind nicht aus Paris. No, no we are not from Paris. Sind Sie the lehrer, are you teacher? Nein, ich bin, ich bin ein Schüler. No, I am a student. Wo ist das Buch? Where is the, uh, the book? Das Buch ist hier. The book is, is here. Du bist aus London. You are from London. Anton ist aus Madrid. Anton is from Madrid. Ihr seid in Deutschland, you are plural in the Germany. Richard and Peter sind fleißig. Richard and Peter are clever. Ich bin Peter. I am Peter. Du bist Paul. You are Paul. Ich bin fleißig. I am, I am clever. Du bist faul. And you. You are lazy. And uh, as you see, we, uh, we saw in the last sentences, all of this uh, personal pronomen, okay, we can so ich, do, but in the third person, we have a three types, masculine is a, er, neutral is s, feminine is the z, okay? For the male, we use a er, for the female, we use a z, but the, some names which are ne neutral, it is special in the Germany, we use s. Lang the Schule Deutsch Do students learn German? As you see here, when we want to make a question form, we bring verb in the first. We change the name and the verb place. Yeah, he learns Deutsch. Yes, he learns he learns German. What is the Bleistift? You see? Here the Bleistift, the pencil, is not a person, but is masculine. It is a male gender. It is here. It is here. For the neutral, for example, get das Kind in the Schule. For example, das Kind is the, in the kid or child we can use in the neutral gender. Does uh, uh, the child go in the school? Yeah, it's getting the Schule. Yes. It goes in the school or he goes in the school. Liegt das Buch dort? Is there the book there? Yeah, it's liegt there. Yes, it is there. It liegt is if there's something placed there, okay? For the female gender, we use sie. Kommt Frau Meyer aus Berlin? Nein, sie kommt aus Köln. No, she is from Köln. Wo liegt die Stadt Hamburg? Where is the, the city Hamburg? Sie liegt in Deutschland. There is in Deutschland, in Germany. <coughs> we go to the Übung 5, 5. Wo liegt das Buch? Where is, where is uh, the book? <laughs> because das Buch is uh, neutral, we can put S. Liegt here. It is here. Liegt der Bleistift auch hier? Is there also Bleistift, uh, the pencil uh, uh, also here? Nein. Uh, it is not uh, here. 
Kunde von Maya kam, das kam, was ist Maya? Nein, no, sie kommt nicht. She doesn't come. Lernt das Kind fleißig. Da, das, die, das lernt the child clever, ja. Es lernt fleißig, ja. Yes, it lernt äh, cleverly. Fragt Herr Müller viel. Äh, das äh, ask Herr Müller so much, viel a lot. Ja. Er fragt viel, yes. He asks a lot, antwortet äh, Richard richtig. Äh, das äh, Richard answer true or truly. Ja. Äh, er antwortet richtig, yes. He, antwort, he answers äh, true, nein. Er antwortet falsch, no. He answers wrong. <lacht> Wo ist die Landkarte? Where is the map? Sie liegt hier, dort. It is there. Is my is my heft here? Is uh, my notebook here? Ja. Es ist hier. Ja. Yes, it is here. Arbeitet Herr Müller viel? Uh, das Herr Müller, Mr. Müller, works a lot. Ja. Er arbeitet viel, ja, yes, he works a lot. Wo ist der Bleistift? Wer ist der Bleistift, der Pencil? Hier liegt er, it is here. Wo ist Frau Mühle? Wer ist uh, Mrs. Müller? Dort kommt sie. Der, uh, she comes. Wo ist das Heft? Wer ist uh, The notebook, here liegt S. Here, is, here it is. We finish here the second lecture. I hope it will be good and we will continue the other lecture in the third lecture. Have a good time.